Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Akira and welcome back, or not back, welcome to this let's play of Finding Paradise. So I just have to adjust my sound here a little. <laughs> so this game is the sequel to um, uh, to the moon and also the sequel to uh, a bird story. If I'm not mistaken, why can't I use uh, my controller for this? Apparently, my controller doesn't work for this game. Okay, then I have to switch over to the keyboard here. So, this game is... There we go. This game is the sequel to, as I said, uh, To the Moon. And also the sequel to Finding... Uh, not Finding Paradise. Uh, a bird story. Uh, this takes place uh, after the bird story thing. Uh, not after, but uh, sometime after. Um, because the boy you played in a bird story is actually the protagonist of this game here. So you're playing his last moments of the world. Um, and it takes place after To the Moon, but how long after? I have no clue. Um, so my plan is just to jump into it and enjoy it. I haven't seen anything about this game at all. Um, in comparison to when I was playing To the Moon, I had seen Let's Plays of it. That was just actually what got me into wanted to play the game in the first place and when I found out that Finding Paradise was coming out soon uh, after I, not soon after but sometime after um, I was um, stoked and looking really forward to it so let's just um, begin and see what um, this story is all about and it looks just as pretty as the first one and yeah so hopefully we doesn't hit a squirrel on the way <laughs> just like the last time so, let's see what this story is all about, and hopefully enjoy some time in it. I have no clue how long this game is, but maybe as long as this last one, so probably 8-9 episodes, I think, so that would be around 4 hours. Um, but I will enjoy it as long as... Once again. Good <laughs> fucking day. Please don't... Well, we did hit the squirrel and a tree. That is something. <laughs> but we like the notch to the old game. <laughs> Dr. Neil Watts. Okay, so. What the f. Eva? Uh, Eva. I actually think it's Eva. I probably mispronounced it all the last time, so. Uh, also, I have no clue what the button is. That's how you keep everyone alive, including the squirrel. I really wish I knew. There we go. Hope you learned something. Look, sometimes it's either us or them. By keeping ourselves alive now, we can be around to stop more self inflicted critter uh, casualties later. Logic. Enlightening. We should be arriving at the patient soon. I could use a snack before then. Do you mind? Whoa. Only you would pack the love box full of apples. Yeah, well, when have you. Uh, <laughs> well, my nephew decorates the Christmas tree with them every year. And then I have to eat uh, for ages. Doesn't sound good. Thinking uh, how old they could be if you have to eat them for ages after Christmas. Apples on a Christmas tree. Huh. Don't you dare say it. Do you mean pineapples? I'm not hungry anymore. Well, well, you'll never see that ball again. Okay, so. 
Check up this uh, red bike. Why can't we go and work on this instead? Because we are here to visit dead people, not to get ourselves killed. Really? I couldn't tell after the trauma of your driving like a stunt double. Besides, we're wishing half dead people. Very different things. Yeah, well, let's hurry and keep it that way. All yours. Okay. Let's roll. Like a co uh, cucumber. What? You know, cucumber rolls. Sushi. Yeah, uh, no. That's quite a stretch. Anyways. Let's see. Huh? There's a, uh, there's a leaking sprinkle over there. Hey now, what happened here? She she kicked my teddy bear. <laughs> no, my teddy into the water. I thought it was warm. Oops. Yeah, well, it's a dumb bear. Does I lose your name here? Who looks like that? But Ma said my my. my Bum bums are pretty. Yeah. Oh, she also. Well, she also named you. Uh, don't worry, we'll get your bear back. Actually, let me take care of this. Why? What do you mean, why? I'm telling you, I got this one. Uh, who helps? Rosaline. Listen, I don't care how many times you get uh, uh, spanked as a kid. You're not their pr uh, parent. Stand down, man. I'll take care of this without getting uh, smeared. Smear. Okay, now I understand why her name is stupid. I didn't see that her name is Potato. What the fuck? Yay! Lame. Should I let the teeth that brat a lesson? Yeah, no. We had too many uh, lawsuits uh, threatened because of you. <laughs> Friends because of you. Okay, but anyways, let's get to our little patient. It's actually a nice house. And in we go. Sophia, hello. Hey there. This is Dr. Rosalina Dr. Watts from Sigmund. You're actually here? Yeah, hope we in time. Um, are we letting us in? I read us out of the door for you. What was that? What was what? Did not feel the blast of ice through the uh, monitor? Well, it's just the patient's uh, sprouts. Then she got a dying uh, sp uh, spouse. I probably put rich around that. It's not like we are here to lay out a picnic. Alright, maybe it's just me. Okay, so we have potato gold up there. Thank you. Spouses, am I right? 
Huh? Oh, this makes the job so cumbersome. Depends on the person. Dr. Rosaline, is it? And uh, Dr. Watts. <clears throat> yes, we're here for Colin. Of course. Thank you both for coming. Right this way. I don't like her. For some reason, she has made her likable. But act one. Tell me, what do you want uh, to change? Huh? This is a uh, quiet place. You got it. You got it. Call us in the uh, other room. Come with me. Right down to business. I like that. Do you actually? Yeah. Cause right now I just really need to put this box down. Well, <laughs> it is heavy. He told us that in the last game, so. You must be here for my father. You're a patient son? Yeah, I came as soon as I heard. But we can talk later. Why don't you get set up first? The box looks heavy. See? He gets it. Where's the medical doctor? He's here. He just went to the washroom. Is that table over there enough for you to get set up? Yeah, that should do. Are you guys ready to get settled? Set the machine down. Yeah, just give us a moment. Is the power here sufficient? Why does everyone keep asking that? It was fine. Sheesh. But first, brace yourself for power outrages of cinematic proportions. I guess we got more stable power grid uh, than our headquarters. It's really consulting as it is worth <laughs> worrying some. You're in good hands. We do this uh, all the time. Too much of t uh, too much of the time, if you ask me. So you two are for real? <sighs> what do you mean? You can really fulfill his wish. Well, certainly try our best, man. But we always succeed because it would only be in his head, though. Not that he'd be able to tell the difference. Anyhow, face up. What is it that he wants? He wouldn't tell us. He said it doesn't affect us and we have nothing to worry about. Well, that sounds legit. Look, that that's okay. We'll find out from his uh, we'll find out from him soon enough. 
it is also in the paperwork. Yeah, but who reads that stuff? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But seriously, where did the fight go? It wasn't in the box. Nope, guess I might lift it in the car. Alright, I guess it's time to, uh, I guess we've got time while we're machine booting up anyway. Uh, I take watch. Rock, paper, scissors, lizards, book, the dick, this out. I rather play logic. You forgot, <laughs> you forgot it. So you go get it. The end. Well played, Spout. Well, off we go then. I'll update the system. It's practically configured itself now. Good. That'll save some time. Alright, down to business, huh? Hey, I remember you. Yeah, it's been a while. Is that the same from um, the other story? Although, weren't Dr. Winter and Dr. Lin assigned to this patient instead? Yeah, but the roosters were filled at the time. So we all heroically volunteered. So now they got no, uh, nothing to do today, though. Hmm. I guess you never knew the timing with the nature of the job. Anyhow, don't mind me, I'm just gonna go check on the patient. So I have to go to the car. Okay, so I have all the same thing as last time. Can I sprint? Neil, don't forget to get the patient status monitor from the Collins medical doc first. Good idea. Wouldn't want to be snoozing when it gives it a, a long note. Yeah, you can be right about that. Here, this should help. Receive the remote patient monitor. Um, Collins heart rate monitor is now activated. Press the escape to right. Or right click to open the menu. Just a little wireless thing. Just hope it doesn't give uh, me uh, tomorrow. Thomas. Okay, but now we can actually see some monitor up there. And now I can go back again. Because I have to get things from the car. Sprinting would be nice. Oh, wrong button. It's not the sprint button. One thing I really hope from this game though is um, that it has... Uh... Oh, so I can actually... Oh, I can switch between characters now. He wasn't kidding. This thing really is configuring itself. Does that now? Yeah, apparently the new uh, paint isn't the only upgrade. I guess that means it, I got some time to snoop around the whole the house. Cool. In the meantime, I'll go monitor the patient like a real doctor. I kid, I kid. Oh God, she's just like Watson. Got to watch. Okay. So I can actually, okay, let's take what's first and then go and get the thing from the car. Because that's the first thing I have to do. Also, you kids are really weird. In your face, Amber. Leave me alone. Uh, where did you bear go? <laughs> where did you bear go? <sighs> what a dumb kid. Hey, attitude. There's a sofa right here, and uh, you gotta sit on uh, cement. I'm not listening. Blah, 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 blah. What a dumb kid. Well. 
let's go to the car and get what we need. And around. There are really a lot of NPCs around in this game too. Uh, I think they're NPCs because there's the woman that's sitting on the bench there and there was a guy uh, earlier uh, when we came here too that I just walked past. So it seems to be a bigger game than before. Isn't this the car? Can you find what you're looking for, please? Dagnabit. <sighs> Dagnabit. Dagnabit. Can you leave it in the office? Dr. Roxana Winters. Hello? Rox, it's me. Neil? Still ha uh, hitting your call ID. The calls from unknown feels like I'm in a horror movie, you know? My bad. I'll turn it off the next time. Oh, I love the surprise. Every time I'm like, am I getting cursed? Are the feeds coming after me? This, the excitement are endless. Uh, Alright, anyway. Look, are you still in the office? I think I left the uh, patient's files on the printer. Oh, okie dokie, pokey dokie. Just give me a moment. Hey, you got the file? E? I think I forgot it back at... You what? Don't worry, I called Roxana. She's gonna find it and send it to me uh, over a scan. Okay, just take care of it. Did you find the drugs? Yep, it was just sitting on your ta table after all. Great, just scan it and... Wait, my table? You're in my room? Yep, you asked me to get the file, right? I meant from the printer in the lobby. How did you get into my room anyway? I locked it. Oh, a girl got her ways. Okay, look, just get out of there and send me the scan, would you? And don't touch anything. I just organized it. Yep, yep, got it. Okay. You guys got everything else you need? Yeah. He's configuring the machine right now. How's the weather out there? What? Is it nice out for a drive? Uh, I guess so. Nino, I think I'll just come over and get your file in person then. What? Why? Just get it and send it over a copy. Well, we've got no patience today. And it's Boring here anyway. Anyhow, don't worry, I'll get there before you guys are done. See you both then. What? Rux? Take a nap. Okay, and now I'm pretty sure yeah, I will go back to her. So I actually, I don't have to switch. I took it someone to show me around. Maybe I can talk to his son. Anything I could help her with, Doc? Um, a 
about Colin. Mind telling me a bit about your father before we get into his head? Well, he's a retired airline pilot and quite the people's person. Worked hard to support the family from the ground up and always made time for us. Although, more recently. But recently, what? Well, nothing unexplained, unacceptable at this stage of life, I suppose. Look, I'd rather not ride out. Th uh, I'd rather not write out the uh, tombstone text before I do. Why don't I show you around before your uh, colleagues come back? Maybe that'll help. I would I would thank you. Uh, no received pilot. Ash has just joined you. <laughs> Ash has just joined the party. Okay. So, notes. Colin used to work at the island. Okay, so something I already knew. So let's start by going over here. A dust is yellow with quite a few snatches across the board. This is my father's old shadow. He played it a lot back in the old days. But not anymore it seemed. Yeah, I guess it's hard on the west. He usually just plays this scales, though he's not extremely, exactly music to be enjoyed. Okay, and the piano? An ancient digital piano. Also my father's or uh, also your father's or No, this is my mother's. She used to uh, allow me to sleep playing with back in the old days. Intentionally, I hope. Okay, so nothing really there left to examine. Let's see. There's a plane here, I think. A model of a small fixed winged aircraft. Huh, is this your dad's? It sure is. I guess I remember it back. Uh, I guess it reminds him back on the uh, way he trains flying those. What is this? I think it's a chair, but I'm not sure. Let's see. Anything in here? A big teeny. Is it your parents? Yeah. <laughs> That's them. I remember being embraced about. Uh, embarrassed about the picture as a kid, but it's kind of sweet that they kept it so well. A part of homegrown hibiscus. Oh, uh, must be hard to uh, uh, to work rooming uh, tropical plants all the way out here. I wouldn't know any better. My mother takes care of them. We had those around the house for as long as I can remember. I guess it's some kind of a family tradition. Okay, then we got them. Anything out in the kitchen? Oops. <laughs> this doesn't seem to be anything. Then we have to go upstairs. I also like that the light turns on and off uh, automatically when you enter exiting a room. I haven't seen many ap um, apartments with multiple floors. Most of my floors are in the. Most of, of, bleh, most of this floor is for maintenance. We just got a little storage room uh, cut out. Sorry about the mess. Seems like they have been doing a bit of cleanup. Actually, I um, when I started out the channel, I actually lived in a house um, in two stores, and <laughs> that was actually weird because it was. Uh, the second and the third floor that was our floor and someone lived on the f uh, first floor under us so we had a two story apartment that was really weird <laughs> seems like they missed one I think I recognize this book it's been around for quite a while my dad kept it uh, it up my dad kept it taped, uh, taped up I guess he didn't want to throw it away Yeah, it's sealed up. He doesn't want anybody reading it though. <laughs> well, under normal circumstances, I say to leave it alone for privacy's sake. 
But he did sign up to become your client, so I don't know. Um, unreal and normal. I really need to know what's inside. There's a chance that I kept. Uh, there's a chance that. There's a chance that it helped the mission. Ugh. Me and reading sometimes. There's nothing in this. Huh? It's nothing but stacks of empty pages glued to the spine. There's all wrinkled too. That's odd. It's been around for ages though. Maybe whatever. The uh, worst on the, in there faded. These aren't recep uh, recepts, but I guess it's possible. Either way, there's not much we can do with this. Let's keep moving. I don't think there's anything left to. I found on page of flying single engine plane. I don't think there's anything more of importance. Unless. No, this is not an entrance or exit. So we can go down again. And then watch Sun. Uh, that watch me. Sure, up soon. Because I can't seem to find any other. Yes? Okay, so she can't do anything. What is it? Uh, Doc's name. Hey, my apologies, but somehow I can't recall your name. That's okay, I prefer to just be called Doctor. Oh, alright. Weirdo. Um, how is the patient doing? He's in a stable condition, at least for now. You're ready to proceed when everything is set up. Sounds good. Neil just getting something from the car while the machine's configuring. Okay, so I should be... Configure system to patients near the lock. Okay, I, and I can't change anything. Okay, so but maybe nothing out here either. Um, is there something I haven't seen yet? I have a lot of notes, but none of them really helps me. I can't see any more spaghetti things anywhere. And I can't go out. There's no need to head out. Neil getting the files already. Yeah. It's also weird that there wasn't anything in this room at all. Oh, there was a back door. I didn't see that at all. <laughs> Oops. Thank you. Why are the toilet paper never on the dispenser? One day, they thank me for the other using hero that I am. Oh, actually, there's something else that might help you prepare. Huh? Okay, so this was where I was looking for. Here's the family photo album. It goes way back. A physical photo album in the day, of, in this day and age, feels like turn of the hearts if I open it. It's quite, but I guess they like having something they can touch. Look through it if you want. I'll go check on my father. I should go get the machine ready too. My colleagues will be back soon, but I'll check this for a bit first. Oh, 
it's cute. I actually like those uh, sprite photo album things here. That's actually pretty neat made. Although his father had way too much the same flow form. Oh, I thought the picture down in the corner was um, uh, broken, but it's still piano lit. <laughs> okay. And Dr. Watch. How, uh, how's we doing here? Good. Um, got my part done. How about the file? You said Roxy is sending the scans. Uh, she said she delivered it in person for some reason. What? What's waste? <laughs> That's wasting both our time and her and hers. Hers mostly. She can still start. We can still start. Still, I mean, I know she's a bit. I can't read that word. I forget that word. In the head at all, but. Whoa, like it's Eve? Anyway, we'll worry about her uh, luminous later. Shall we start? Alright, just get the patient equipped up. Uh, Neil? Hmm? Never mind. We'll talk later. You have it is on this, uh... With... With liner. We all set. Communication memory uh, traversal ready. Wait. Before you begin, could you tell me what you'll be doing in there? Uh, we're going through his memories to, uh, to grant him his wish, uh, last wish, duh. I thought you already know. Yes, I do know that, but. How? What will you actually be doing? Well... I will elaborate on that. We actually don't do much. It's the machine that does most of the work. Says the technician. Who knows, who knows best, of course. Uh, the machine calculates uh, permittance the possibilities it creates new targets of life in the form of memories of course it's an illusion but to him it would be indistinguishable from the lifetime of real memories however the parameters the machine calculates would still have to be logical uh, logically cohesive so it needs a starting point and a change and a change and a ch change in the key available and that's where we come in we tunnel through his memories from the most recent to as far back as we need drawing a line from now to then we then be able to help colin transfer his conscious motivation all the way to his past so in the simulation life return, he made all the kickers the decision and fulfill his own wish. Just by his own uh, violation, is that enough? I haven't thought that fulfilling wishes would be uh, would make uh, would take more than just effort and second chance. I mean, can you two just make whatever needs to happen happen? 
continue to explain. I, st- I want to know this myself, so... Perhaps... But our problem is he's not brain dead. But one problem is he's not brain dead. There are a few things that uphold uh, the illusion of reality. Illogical happenstance aren't one of them. And since the world still must... And since the world still must be self cohesent, uh, we can't do more than simply influence him. Besides, you don't get paid enough to generate memorized manipulation. It's not a cave printing. A cave painting. There's little need for interference anyhow. Willpower is usually more than enough. Not everyone can reach the goal in life. T- uh, time changes then. Motivation come and go. They always start strong. Then, um, then play to your then fade. But in a simulation based on the mental state of a single moment, dresses through a lifetime. Let's just say this is some powerful wonder man. Anyhow, uh, no amount of violations gonna help a dead man. Still, we proceed. Yes, thank you for the explanation. I don't know what's gonna happen in the end, but good luck. Locks for lotteries. We're professionals. Oh, sharp words. See you on the other side. And we're in. Patient is stable and ready. It is like memory traverse sequence in three, two, one, go. And we're inside. And of course, the counter the counter is back. Alright, this should be Colin's uh, last acceptable memory. Yeah, and check out the uh, degrading Harry's sleep chamber over here. Leave the memory of her alone. She's not our client. By the way, I wanted to ask earlier. What with the helm uh, you put on our patient? Huh? The equipment it looked different. Oh, it's just rem- I just removed the casing doing maintenance, that's all. Then why didn't you put it back? Hey, that reminds me. Did you know I added a new feature? New feature? Behold! No one forget I asked. <laughs> Character customization. What the fuck? <laughs> Why, Watson? Why? And I can't see anything. Okay, I will just keep it as it is. Ta da! You look the same. Huh? I guess this isn't corrupted that my Hansen is looking just how I am. I wonder though, why are you looking at me like that? Okay, listen, you better not be. Tech, you're it! Neil, you son of a. She could get me to, oh god, no! I still don't know why sucks is a possibility. I don't want to change anything though. Let's just keep the rest of it on. Huh? A 
I guess we'll both find the way we are. I was hoping for some fireworks, but I guess the system that chose it was being kind. Well, that's a lovely system. Yeah, it's good, cool. Alright, let's go find Collins before uh, he expires. Hmm. The current memory is persistent in time can be reviewed by moving your mouse towards the top of the screen. Okay. Oh, let's turn off world interference before we walk, uh, wake up. After all that, I'm surprised we didn't already. Okay, so we are going straight into the new uh, game here, and I have gone on way longer than I expected. But <laughs> that's how it is with the um, game sometimes when I start new one. So I will just save here. File one, make sure that it's saved. It is. It also has a auto save, I can see. But um, yeah. With that, I will end this episode off here and continue the next one. So I hope you enjoyed this one. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more videos, and I hope you all will have an awesome day. So until next time, farewell. <laughs>